Hello everyone. In this session we are going to discuss some more ways to target or use a class or ID inside the CSS. So first we are going to discuss how we can assign multiple classes to the single HTML element. We can apply different classes to same HTML elements by giving space separated class names. For example, we have a demo.html inside that we are using over here external types of CSS and the name of that file is test.css in the test.css we have used two different classes class 1 and class 2 class 1 specify color blue and class 2 defines text align center so what I want, I want class 1's property as well as class 2's property to apply on a single HTML element. So how I can do, I can use a space separated class name values inside the class attribute. Initially what we were doing, we were writing h1 class equal to class 1 because I want to specify only a single class to that particular element. But if I want to specify properties of two different classes in the same HTML element, I can use space separated class names. So the output would be it is uh, color, it, its color also changed as well as its text align property also changed to center. So this is how we can specify multiple classes to the single element. Next, multiple selection. For example, I want to specify color same property to different elements inside the HTML. What I can do, I can use a comma separated values inside my selector. Let's see an example. Same, there is one paragraph p tag as well as h1 tag, heading tag. I want to target both of them in my CSS. So how I can do? I am writing my test.css I am writing color blue what I want is I want color blue property set for both paragraph as well as h1 so what I need to write in select, uh, selector here is p comma h1 so comma separated values in a selector will use multiple selection method and apply color to both P as well as H1. So this is how we can use multiple selection, comma separated values. And the output is both paragraph and H1 having color blue. Next is a multi-level selection. For example, we want to use some hierarchy, hierarchical path to target element. We can use space separated element or class or ID names in a selector. Let's see an example. For example, I want to target h1 which are inside some division. Only the h1s which are written inside the div tag I want to target. So what I can do, I can write div space h1. So what that means, I want to only apply this color to the h1s which are inside a division div so this h1 will not be colored blue why because it is it its uh, parent is not div only this h1 will uh, be colored blue because this h1 is inside this particular div so the output of this will be this. First h1 is not colored as a blue and second is colored blue. Same space separated element, a class or ID anything. We can use combinations of them also. Some elements, some class, some ID but that must be space separated. Ready? Here there are uh, the student might get com confused over here. We have used space separated selector over here space separated selector inside CSS is for multi-level selection and same 
as we have no uh, see, uh, first seen multiple classes in that particular class we have used space separated class names in our html if we specify space sep uh, separated classes in our H html it will be multiple classes it will assign multiple classes whereas if i am using that particular space separated value as a selector in css it will be multi level selection